Hey, okay, welcome to another day. Chest today, biceps, stomach, and neck. Okay, so I think we all created a good program here. But I can see as I'm getting stronger, I need to prioritize a little bit. Can't do everything here. I have uh, noticed that I have not been so controlled on the control days. So I think we uh, just need to see how we are going to be doing with the control thing. That's, uh, we have a choice, we can move control over here, we go like controlled every day, but I'm moving strength over here and focusing on strength now. Stretching isn't going that well, that happened only once in a while, and I haven't been so good with the feeders, feeder, but we are increasing in strength. And I think that's the main focus and priority right now. But I really want to include some feelers here because my arms and shoulders did really grow when I was doing them regularly. Notice that it's hard to do everything. Yeah. And let's update the weight and see if there's something different. Di see if there's anything different there. Okay, so we have a little update to the weight there, 93.9, increasing a little bit in weight there, that means that something is happening, so I think that's a good, good thing, yeah, the juicer I got the other day here and I found a recipe here that could be helpful, I think I'm going to be making a little juice, so join me for that. Okay guys, gonna gather the ingredients that uh, we need for this lemon ginger blast recipe for juicy. Give you some energy, detoxification, help your body throughout the day with some many properties and many different ingredients. So let's start. Ginger. I'm gonna make a double recipe. So if you are one person, you may want to make half of this. Apple, celery, habanero, strong pepper, cucumber, cilantro. You can also use parsley or mint. Lemon. I couldn't find fresh turmeric, so I'm gonna drizzle a little bit of that spice dried turmeric in it. Guess I'm gonna be adding another cucumber. Cucumber. Uh, we could have another herb in here. So I'm gonna cut this up. Guess you wanna be having this lemon ginger blast first thing in the morning on empty stomach to get the maximum potency. So. May want to remove the seeds before it go into the juicer. Cucumber. This is a great drink for fat loss and energy and everything. This could be a breakfast for many people. But since I'm into the muscle building thing right now, it doesn't provide enough uh, calories to make it uh, so that I can have it only for breakfast. Need to cut away a little bit because it wasn't that supposed to be a little bit more vibrant looking. It's a bit pale. Cilantro. Gonna rinse it. Sorry. 
French this, this two, and the habanero. This one is enough for two people. But you need to go by the feel of it. I don't want to go overboard. Rinse these. Look at that. I guess you can have a, one more app below to it. But this is for two portions. Okay, now so we can bring the juicer. Now I have assembled it and we can power it up. Let's start the juicing. The herbs you want to have with uh, watery stuff. I don't know how this is going to be. I'm a little bit careful with the turmeric spice there. Okay. How much is this? Around one liter. Okay, let's have a taste. I'm nervous about the ginger and the habanero. No joke, no joke. That habanero. It tastes good, but it's strong. The first swallow was the toughest one. I think I can ease into it. I'm just gonna see there. Enjoy it. Bottom this down.
Okay, I think that went pretty smooth though. But also, it is pretty strong with the habanero. You can, may want to be a little bit more careful with, with that one if you want. You're doing this in the morning on an empty stomach, so maybe the stomach is a bit vulnerable. But you'll see. I'm gonna make my breakfast now. Even though this is good and then you can go out for a morning run or a walk and plenty of energy here. I tell you that. But uh, gonna, I'm gonna hit the gym doing some heavy doing some heavy weights. Take this to the sink. Yeah, I have the other meal going on now. Maybe I'm gonna have a banana to dessert or some coconut oil or something. But that's not certain. Maybe this is plenty. Three slices, bread here, and uh, four eggs. I have the four eggs in the pan and divided it into these three slices of bread. I think I'm ready for the gym after eating this. So I have some spices some on top here some uh, little spicy spices and then I have uh, had some butter on the bread and a uh, little bit of that dried onion and uh, some mustard and there's some ketchup on top here yeah this is good Okay. Okay, <clears throat> that was a good breakfast. Then we're ready for the gym. So see you guys down there. Boom! 
Hi, you can see here, throw together some spaghetti, meat, I threw some spices on here, a little bit of onion and some ketchup. I'm gonna have that right after the workout now. Uh, had a little bit of this, orange. And I'll see you guys later. Okay, I'm back again. I have some food going on here, a couple of bananas and a carrot. And I fix some bread and a bit, little bit of cheese and some cucumber and bell pepper, paprika. And then I have some cottage cheese going on here. You may want to eat half of that or, or maybe more, I'll see. I can always save some for later. Just a little meal update. Just gonna have this and that'll do for now. Okay. Hey, okay, it's been a nice day. It's time to end the episode. But before that, something I forgot to mention. Have some uh, improvements here on the squat earlier this week. Went from 170. and 75. So that helps, we are increasing here, so definitely strength main priority right now. So thanks for following along, um, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, give the video a thumb up and I'll see you guys in further episodes.